no, Kathy rang and said we want it to be non-political and someone loud. So I'm the only non-political loud person in Fremantle. So who's really enjoyed coming today and wandering around? You don't get this experience when you do your shopping at Coles, do you? I just saw a little boy, he was outside the honey tent and he went tearing towards his dad going, Dad, Dad, you've got to taste this honey, it's fantastic! And I thought, yep, it doesn't happen in Coles. So, come on, you come up here. What's your name? Hey? Arla. Arla, why did you come here today? Because I want to because I want because my because this is the new opening of the farmer's market. Oh my god! Oh. Yes, they grab a ribbon. We're gonna make a great big circle. Yeah, we're gonna join them all together. Because you know, if a farmer's market like this won't work if there's only one or two groups of people involved. It takes the people who grow the food, it takes the people who bring it here so we can enjoy it, it takes the people who make lo lovely breakfasts for us. All right, we have an official opening ribbon now. Now what we need is someone really important to cut the ribbon. Is there anyone really important in the audience? Do we have really, anyone really, really important audience, no one's more important than us, are they? Your mum's here. All right, Jacinta, get your mum to come forward. We're going to give her some scissors. So all those people who are hanging on to our ribbon here, we are going to get, in fact, you know what? We're all going to have a ribbon. Scissors. Well done, Pat. Hang on. No, no, we've got more. We're going to have more than one. Who's got a pair of scissors? Anyone else? Here you go. Come forward if you want to have a cut of the ribbon. And then, yeah, don't do anything. I used to be a school principal, mate. Don't go just cutting things. I'm not good on you, instruction. You need to be really, really careful doing that. No use being told. All right, have we all got a ribbon? We've got something to cut? All right, what we're going to do is we're going to go, we're going to go hip hip parade three times. And on the third hip hip parade, we're going to cut the ribbon for the opening of South Fremantle. Growers Green. Green. Oh, there's more scissors. Come on, Sam. Spots. Little boy, little crew kids, come on. You won't have this much excitement this week. All right, are you ready? No. This is three cheers for the South Fremantle Growers Green. Hip hip. Another three cheers for the very, very um, hard-working group of organisers who've actually put this together today. Kathy, Ingrid and Sonia from South Fremantle. And also a big thank you to the high school who's um, allowed us to use their land. It was funny, I was talking to Jerry Hardy on the way down and she was saying, oh, I was hoping there'd be a few cars. I think there's more cars here than there is during a school day. She's very excited there's more people here, so that's fantastic for the school and thank you Jerry for allowing us to do that. So let's have three big cheers. Kathy, Ingrid, Sonia, where are they? And Georgie, of course. Come forward, Georgie. Georgie's important in another life, but that's okay. All right, three cheers for organizing this wonderful event today. Hip hip. Hip hip. Hip hip. Well done. Go out, enjoy yourselves, buy healthy food, buy local things. And the store holders! Yay! Yay! Because you know what? Actually, that's a good point. Because they were here at 4.30. And you know what? There wouldn't be much to come for if they weren't here, really, would there? So don't forget, every Sunday morning, after church, before church, instead of church, you can come down to Growers Green down here um, and meet your friends. Say hello to people, entertain the kids. They've done a marvellous job and I can't wait for Sunday mornings for the rest of the year. Yay! Yay. Thank you.